up early, baby. You heard mommy, huh? The sunset or sunrise looks so pretty in the background. You can't really see it. it kind of washes it out. Um, but all the trees are already up. I need to clean the sink today, and I made champarado last night, but yeah, I already have my coffee done, yum, vanilla is still my favorite, I saw they had a Nespresso advent calendar, I'm going to look into it today and see if I want to try it out, I think that would be fun, but anyways, I'm going to drink my coffee. So I just took out the air fryer. <laughs> we have the beautiful, I think that's, yeah, beautiful air fryer in white. I think I showed it to you guys, right? Well, I love it. <clears throat> it's so pretty. Um, I haven't used our blender yet, but we've used our toaster, which I'm gonna use today too, since I'm making toast. Um, but I use this for pretty much everything, even, soft boiled eggs making three soft boiled eggs and i always put a, a tin foil in here because if i don't the eggs kind of like rattle because it's just on metal you know and then <laughs> it freaks me out so i just grab some tin foil and i make like a little let me just put it in there like a little thing like that then you put the eggs in there. And you literally put it in the air fryer for 370 for seven minutes. 370 for eight minutes is what I have been doing. There we go. And start. And for toast, I'm just gonna do <clears throat> look at this toaster. It's so pretty. Oh, and by the way, I got these command hooks to put on the back of them, and it just kind of holds all the wires together because you know that gets pretty crazy sometimes. No toast for me. This looks awful. I don't know. It smells funny to me. I don't like it. I don't know the last... This is November 2nd. So, no. I'm just going to have this, I guess, <laughs> for today. Yeah. Daddy got a present from Liam. What uh, is it? <laughs> buying Yoda. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> Say happy birthday. Liam, say happy. Oh, jeez. And then that one is for me. I wonder what it is. I don't think you can open that in here. Be careful now. You just hurt yourself, so. I think I like the, the whole side open, to be honest with you. I don't think, Liam, can you come back over here? I don't know what that is exactly. Like, isn't there like a blade or something? Okay, don't open it until you have to use it. <laughs> Happy birthday, that's it? Oh, I was going to say. It's a chainsaw, right? 
I don't know. What could it be for me? You picked it out. There's no name on it. I told you, I think like the whole half opens. Oh my god, you're gonna hurt yourself. This is what's for dinner. Miso and maple glazed tilapia. I made rice for myself though. So that's the cucumber thing. Here's the tilapia with the glaze. Yummy. Here's the barley with the veggies. Time to eat. Oh my god. <laughs> Um. <laughs> Liam. There we go. There we go. You guys sing. Happy birthday, Daddy. Happy birthday, Daddy. Happy birthday to Daddy. Happy birthday to you. Yeah. Make a wish. Wow. Yay. Say happy birthday. Happy. Oh, good job. I can barely hear him. And Tom's little, I forgot what it's called again. Trace leches? Yeah. Yeah. I almost said those are delicious again. <laughs> Yummy. You gonna share? A little bit. <laughs> I forgot to end the vlog last night. 
I was packing orders and right after I finished, I was just so tired that I just hung out with the boys on the couch and finally relaxed. Um, but yeah, so today I'll go ahead and end this vlog by decorating the coffee bar. I was gonna skip Thanksgiving or like fall coffee bar decor, but I just, my heart just can't do it. And plus we are hosting um, Thanksgiving next week. So I'm like, it'll be nice to have some fall in the house, you know? So we'll go ahead and do that right now. I'll just be like a super quick decorate with me. But you guys, I finally had time like earlier uh, to touch all my watercolor stuff. So I did film my first video and in that video, I swatched all of the watercolors from my pan with you. And then right after that, um, I ended the video with that. But then right after, I was like, oh, let me just test out um, my watercoloring notebook. So let me show you. So I'll do a proper video on this, but I just kind of want to show you. So this is a notebook that I got, right? You'll see this in the video. But... I did this off camera and it sucks. Like it does not work good with the watercolor. Like to be able to get this, I had to put so much water on it and like really soak it and layer the watercolor. But this is what it looks like when you are painting with the watercolor on it. It's just awful. Um, I think this is just mainly for the brush pens. Which is sad because I wanted just one notebook to do all my watercolor in. So I don't know what I'm going to do with this. I don't know. I I mean, I already used one page. I don't think I can return it. You know what I mean? Or I can just keep it and like play around with it. I don't know. We'll see. It just sucks that it doesn't work with the watercolor pan that I plan on using. You know? So anyways... Good thing I picked up the cheap, like a cheap watercoloring pad at the dollar store today. Oh, by the way, speaking of the dollar store, we went to a dollar store this morning. I had to drop off um, all the orders at the post office. And just a few blocks away is a brand new Dollar General, General, which is super close to our house. You guys know we live in the middle of nowhere. So I was like, oh my God. There's a store other than the grocery and post office. <laughs> so we had a lot of fun just kind of like browsing the store. It was so cute and I got some really cute stuff. So um, yeah, anyways, that's that. That's all I did. I need to clean out my pan here, but I'll do that in a second. I did post on Instagram that I did um, this. So I was just playing. I was upset with the with my notebook and so I was like, let me test out this pad. This is great. So I did this off camera. I'll I'll try and film it, like do a different one. Cause I didn't know how it was gonna go and I was like, oh. And I actually did pretty dang good. So there's a picture on Instagram of this. You can see it closer, kind of, oh, there you go. Yeah, um, but yeah, I did post this on Instagram, but I wanna do it again and see if I can make it better. You know, so this is my first time. And not too bad for the first time, right? I'm so excited. So, yeah, this is $5 at the dollar store, this pad. So, I'm going to use this for, like, practice and stuff. But I do um, want to get, like, an actual, like, notebook, like this one, um, for watercoloring. So, I guess it's, like, burp there, sorry. But, um, yeah, I guess I want to get, like, a notebook. So, I'm looking online and yeah, maybe I'm thinking Liam and I will go to um, the art supply store sometime this weekend. We'll see. Um, and just like look at what they have because I'm sure they have something there. Otherwise, I'll just go on Amazon and buy something. Um, but yeah, also really love this brush. I show all of this in the video. Look at this. This is the expensive brush. I think I paid... $15 for this plus shipping. It was not free shipping on Amazon. It was like $7 for shipping, something crazy like that. But anyways, 
I got these uh, super cheap paint brushes. It's like a set of five. And look, this one's stained. And this is as clean as I can get it. <laughs> so, don't really recommend that one. But I mean, it was fine. It just like was smearing colors everywhere though because it wasn't cleaning good enough or whatever between um, colors. But this one though, this, this sable hair is beautiful worked really well i want more of it but i looked just now at the prices because you guys know prices on amazon fluctuates a lot it's so expensive right now so i'm gonna have to wait or maybe ask for christmas like for a few brushes for christmas i don't know we'll see it's just it's just expensive but anyways okay i'm gonna go and um what's it called decorate the coffee bar with you now because i want to wrap up this vlog and then edit it and yeah okay let's go coins all right so for fall i'm just gonna reuse the pumpkins that i have here right now it's just like orange and green and then i'm probably most likely gonna use this beaded garland that i got from hobby lobby i think i can find this online i'll see and then everything I got from the Target Dollar Spot. So I got these cute little um, dish towels. I like to put one here. I don't know why. By my coffee bar. So this one says Hello Pumpkin. But I'm going to use this one. I like just the pumpkin pattern. And then look at this. Isn't this adorable? This is $5 at Target. But I, when I picked it up it was already half off. Because they were putting out the Christmas stuff already so it was only $2.50 and this one was $5 as well half off it's such a good deal on that so anyways it comes with a sign there a sign there another sign here a little truck and a welcome thing and then I also picked up this cute little candle this one was $3 also half off when I picked it up so yes we are excited I'm sad that I'm gonna take this down though so yeah, I'm going to go ahead and fast forward right now because I want to change it up. You guys this is the finished look really simple but i like it it's cute so here's a close-up of the tray we used some of the items i already had but mixed in the new and then i found this sign i think i got this last year one of my friends gifted it to me it's so cute and then i switched this to my pumpkin container from target and there you go hope you all enjoyed see you in our next vlog